Governor Kay Ivey decides to accept the FirstNet and AT&T's plan to de deliver a wireless broadband network to the state's public safety community. The network will bring advanced tools to help first responders save lives and protect communities. Former Calhoun County Sheriff and FirstNet Public Safety Advisory Council member Larry Amerson says technology has come a long way. The very first time we saw, I saw technology used, I had a deputy who had a flip cell phone and he took a picture of a bank robbery vehicle and he sent it to his buddies on the shift with him and one of them saw the vehicle and made an arrest. We didn't do it because we had a good system, they did it because they had some ingenuity, but we need to use this stuff every day and this will allow us to use uh, the technology that exists for there so many ways we can't even imagine them all yet, but it's going to be there. Governor Ivey says keeping Alabama residents, visitors, and first responders safe is of the highest concern. AT&T plans to build, operate, and maintain the highly secure wireless broadband communication network at no cost to the state. Ivey says the first net network will drive innovation and create an entire system of modernized devices, apps, and tools for first responders.